Welcome back to the basement, the friendliest place on YouTube. This, uh, whoop, okay. This place needs a roof. Uh, I think it's high time we fixed that little issue, and I built myself a little dirt staircase to get up here so I could start the episode there. But yeah, that's um, <clears throat> one of our goals today. We're going to put a roof on this place. Have I done anything since I last saw you? I dug around down here. I did not find much diamonds. Um... So that's kind of a bummer. I moved the chests in here and built a few more and organized a little. So just to help myself, we got uh, stone in here, wood in there, blocks in general in there, um, some building materials in there, food stuff in there, and precious materials in here. I may need to make another diamond pickaxe um, and enchant it so we can see what we can get. Because right now we're rocking this Unbreaking 3... So touch one, efficiency five, which is amazing. I'd love to get, or efficiency four. I'd love to get another efficiency four pick. So let's do that and grab a little bit of lapis, and then we're going to uh, work on the roof a fair bit. Now let's see if we can get anything good going with this. Silk touch. I mean, that could have efficiency four on it also and then that would be worth combining there or we could one level enchant something else like maybe the hoe uh, since we have enough experience knockback looting knockback let's try it okay we got knockback now let's try this again unbreaking three efficiency two uh, we'll just try this and see if it's got efficiency four on it no, but it does have fortune. So it's not very efficient, but it can replace this one. Ooh. No, I can't combine two things of not like kinds on an anvil. So it is what it is. We're going to need more diamonds before we can really pursue that well. Although we could see what a diamond sword would get us. I'm just not sure it's the next best thing to spend on. I love my helmet. I'm going to need a different... We gotta add protection four to that. I'm gonna need a different diamond chest plate altogether. I don't like the thorns. And then yeah, we need diamonds for those things. So to wash away our sorrows, let's take um, six or three stacks of stone and turn it into three stacks of the stone brick. And then we ought to be able to turn these into three stacks. Of this. I hate how slow this goes when you use the joystick but there's no great alternative I don't think like this isn't much better okay so how is the roof going to look that's a great question how it's going to look is uh, a little plain and a little sharp so my idea is I need more blocks I need some dark oak we're going to use dark oak on the roof, so the roof's a bit of a different color. And I almost went over to the old spot for wood before I remembered it's in here. Um, yeah, so let's grab a stack of this and turn it into four stacks of this. And then can we use the stone cutter to make these into stairs? No. So is there a better way to make these into stairs than to do it in here? Probably. But I don't know what it is. What is the block that, uh, let's see, cartography, fletching, no. Grindstone smoker, no, no. Smithing, no. Yeah, there may not be a better way. So let's do this and we'll get um, started. Maybe we should grab some more wood. Okay. <clears throat> so, ooh, the sun is almost going down. The way this is gonna work how is this going to work exactly? I don't know. Didn't totally plan it out. Let's see. We could put this here like that. That's what we want. And then one on the outside as well. Whoops. Can we do it from down here? Yes, we can. Okay. Um, Let's sleep so it's morning and then we can try again. How's everybody doing today? <clears throat> you excited for some more Minecraft? I'm excited to improve this building and uh, go get some diamonds. I'd also like to travel to a uh, 
fortress in the nether, but I'm not sure if that's going to happen today or not. Okay, so let's use this little roof here to our benefit. Yeah, like this. And let's see, we're going to need one here as well. So this will give us just a little bit of a curve out like this. There, there, and one more from the ground. Yeah. Then we'll do the same thing on the uh, outside as well. So just a moment, let me uh, get that in place and I'll join you guys when I'm done. Alrighty, we've got the rest of the roof in place, as you can see there. I mean, the rest of this beginning outline. So now it's time to start adding the dark oak. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to get this out of the way. And we're going to start with a little bit of dirt. And it's going to go up like this. Okay, there's one, two, three. So one, two, three. Hmm, probably go a couple more here. And let's see, we'll go like that and like that. And then the top one will go here. And so the way this will work is like this. And because we have an odd number there, the top one will be slabs. And it might be stone slabs, it might be dark oak slabs. We'll just see what looks better. So the idea is to have this kind of shape, but all the way yeah, out to here, and then following the whole curve of the stone. So I'll get that in place and uh, check in. Oh, all right, guys, I am back, and here's what the roof looks like as of right now. Uh, we got a little bit of cleanup to do. Obviously, that does not go there. <clears throat> we need to put the slabs across the top uh, here. Ooh, and do I want stairs here? We'll start with that, but that could be a stair eventually. So let's get rid of this dirt block. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that like that, but I might be able to do it, oh, come on, like this. Come on now. There we go. Wait a minute. It's too wide at the top? All right, because we have an even dimension on one part of the house and an odd dimension on the other. Oh well, that's okay. Nope, yep, perfect. Okay. So this... So let's stick torches in all the corners here. Whoops, that's not a corner. Like this. And I think this will make this attic spawn-proof. For now. Um... But we're probably going to want to do... Actually, do I still want to set this one in? I bet I do. we we'll put it here. I wonder if a single stack is going to be enough. That's all I grabbed. Okay, so we could put like, um, like a skinny window here with just fence posts in it, I think. Or we could go ahead and put glass in there. I'm just not sure what's right. Maybe we'll do one on each side, and then you guys can give me your opinions. Oh, and I'm out of spruce. Oh, jeepers. You can tell I'm not a professional builder. Okay. One, two, three. There we go. I love the building noises in Minecraft. It lets me know that I'm having fun accomplishing something menial yet satisfying. Puh, 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 puh. Okay. So once again, the oh, except this is going to need to be bigger. So I'm not going to have enough fence posts for both sides. Maybe this one will have to be glass. So let's say we're going to make that one glass for now. 
Or we could just make some more of these. I want to see how this looks, though. Yeah, could that be okay if it were just glass? Or is it a little too silly? Does it need to be fence? I think fence is probably the way to go. So we'll need a few more. This has taken a couple of Minecraft days to get this done, but it's good work. It's worth it. Um, so let's sleep real quick, and then we'll grab some more dark oak, get those fences in place, and it will be time to move on to the next exciting thing. What the heck are you? Woo, it scared me. He hit me with an enchanted shovel. Jump scare. I, well, the first thing I thought it was was a phantom, which only attack you if you haven't slept in a bed for several days. I thought that couldn't be right. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. I don't love the exposed dark oak on the underside of the roof, so I may have to put some upside down stair, stone brick stairs there. Uh, but that's okay. That's not hard to do, and I'll do it off camera. All right, so uh, more diamonds is I think I think is our next goal, and we want to go X positive. That's our plan. So let's put away our stuff in a junk drawer. These are junk drawers, as you can plainly see. That helps us to put away things quickly while we're recording, and then we can uh, sort it out later. Okay, so what are we doing? We're looking for diamonds. And this is our silk touch pickaxe, so we may as well use it. I could combine it with that, but that's not going to change anything about it. I'm not going to use the fortune too, though. Maybe I'll use it on the coal. I don't know. But down in the mines we go. Do I need to bring any wood with me? I guess I've got four birch logs. That'll be enough. So right now we're traveling Z positive, which means X positive is going to be this way. So this goes until about 500. Oh, one of these actually was exciting. Um, it's the one with the torches in the floor. Yeah, this direction. Okay, so my plan was to dig all the way until... Oh, uh, was it 500 or 0 in this direction? I don't remember. Some round X value. Oh, hello. <clears throat> but then I discovered an interesting looking cave and decided to wait till you guys were with me to explore. So that's what we're going to do. Um, I do have plans to go into the nether uh, a little more at some point. Let's see. I don't know how actually exciting this is. Where's the excitement? I guess that's some excitement. Oh, here's some more. We have a zombie villager. Two of them. And I see light. Now we're down at Y equals 12, which means discovering diamonds at any point is totally possible. Oh, a slime block. Hello, buddy. I did not bring my water bucket. So we'll have to be careful around the lava. More careful than we would be if we had our bucket. Okay, that all seems to be in order. Um, I don't want to try up there yet. Let's just keep going this way. Hmm. That gravel wants to fall, I can tell. Here's this. This guy that I didn't want to do. Diamonds? No. Do I have a bucket with me? Oh, I do have my water bucket. Okay. Let's get these things out of the way and maybe put some stone there in case I need to suddenly use it. Do, 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 do. Uh, ooh. Thought I saw something good there. Boop. Two, 
too high up here, but it does come back down. And there's gold. Gold's always nice. Definitely trying to keep an eye out for diamonds. But it seems as though there's none. What in the world are we going to do? I don't know why I thought this cave looked more exciting than I feel like it is now. Um, something about the shape of it made me mark it and leave it until later. Let's try this way. More water. Dead end? Yep. Alright, so let's go back to our place. Our, like this. My, you're a big boy. What's up, little guys? Give me some slimes. Uh, where did we come from? Here? Yeah, from here. Okay, so maybe things get more interesting if I, we go straight. I just don't know. Let's see, where is this? This is on 129 for some reason. So let's get back to Z equals 129. Uh-oh. Thirty-two, one thirty-one, no go there. Uh, one thirty, one twenty-nine. So there's our path. All right, come on now, diamonds. Really could use a big ore at some point here. Or it'd be fun to break into something interesting. Guess we'll just have to wait and see. You never know what's behind the next block. Alright, dug to zero, which was my goal. And there's actually a little opening here. So let's see if we can actually see anything interesting. I don't like that. That's extremely dangerous. In fact, I don't even like that being like that. So let's... Let's see about this way. Is this just an immediate dead end? Yes. Alright, no diamonds. That was a bit of a bust. Let's head back. I'll meet you guys there. It's a dark and stormy night. Let's sleep it off. Well, hello, Mr. Zombie. Can I help you die? You're welcome. Okay, we're gonna go into the nether. We're gonna, um, dig a ways. And what do I need for that? I need, oh, hello. Actually, that might be some good armor. Uh, there's thorns on the helmet. Not that good, actually. So we need to empty out our inventory into the junk drawer. And we need to grab some good stuff for the nether, probably including gravel. And not a bucket of water, because what good would that do? So I'm going to suit up, and uh, I'll meet you guys in the nether. All right, guys, we're in the nether. It's a beautiful day in the bee in the nether. We're going to... Um, there's our portal right here. We're going to staircase up here. 
and hope that it goes as well as I'm hoping it will. Uh, all the way up to the ceiling, and then we're going to start tunneling. So I'll see you guys up at the top. Ah! I can't believe how much trouble this is giving me. This is it, I'm gonna die, my stuff's gonna burn! stop recording now. I'll see you guys when I see you in the basement. Welcome back to the basement. Friendliest place on YouTube. I've had just about enough uh, moping and it's time for us to rebuild what we had. So we've got nothing in our inventory right now. We can't go into the nether uh, because of how much of a mess I made of everything. So we're going to rebuild. Um, the first thing we need is a full set of armor. So helmet, chest plate, leggings, and boots. We're also going to need a bucket for water, because uh, we are going mining. Uh, there we go. All dressed, okay? Now we're going to need wood. Um, the good news is, is even though we lost a bunch, we still have a bunch, right? We've got all this wood. We've got, uh, coal. Do we have coal? Where's my precious stuff? Right here. We've got food, I think. So we're, we're fairly well outfitted, and we even have lots of lapis. So you know what I want to do, actually, is I want to stick a piece of coal in here and get some experience going. So we can enchant all this new armor and all of our new iron tools and weapons. All right, we're up to 51 levels of experience and we're gonna make ourselves um, a half stack of planks worth of sticks, which is 64. And then we're gonna use our iron and our sticks to make ourselves, um, I think we go ahead and make a diamond sword because we have two diamonds. And then we make ourselves a couple of iron pickaxes, um, one shovel, and one axe. And I don't think we need a hoe. So we might be ready to put um, 27 of our stack, what used to be a stack of iron back. And then let's see about doing some enchanting. I hear a zombie somewhere. Oh, hi there. You seem to be a problematic place for me to let skeletons hide. Hey, maybe we just got a really nice enchanted bow. That would cheer me up a little bit. No creepers anywhere? What do we got here? Power 2, punch 1. Alright, I'm going to see about some enchants, and uh, I'll let you guys know what I ended up with. Alrighty, I think we are ready to go mining to recover our diamonds. We ended up with sharpness 3 on our sword, using our last two diamonds. We do have a unbreaking 3 efficiency 4 silk touch pickaxe, uh, actually as well as an unbreaking 3 efficiency 4 fortune 3 pickaxe. So both unbreaking 3 and efficiency 4, one silk touch, one fortune 3. We got an uh, unbreaking and efficient shovel, a sharp and unbreaking axe, and we ended up with Feather Falling 4, Blast Protection 4, Unbreaking 3 on the boots, Projectile Protection 4, Unbreaking 3 on the leggings, Protection 3 on the chest plate, and the combination of Aqua Affinity and Respiration 3 on the helmet is great. I'd rather have Protection 4 than Projectile Protection, and I'm a bit upset about the thorns. But it's just iron armor. So... Uh, we're all stocked up. We've got wood, we've got coal, we've got sticks, 
We've got torches. We've got food. All we need is water in our bucket. And I keep hearing a zombie. I wonder if there's one in our attic or not. He's not going anywhere if there is. So I'm not too worried about him. So let's grab some water. And, uh... It's time to stop moping. And it's time to get... Our diamonds back. So I think the plan is going to be... I was thinking about this last night. Laying in bed. Thinking about what I always do is I dig north and west and south and east from one room. And then my branches all intersect because I have to dig squares that turn the corner like this. And I think I want to stop that practice. I think I just want to dig up just all, uh, let's say, north and south. And then have my branches go sideways for a very long time. So that's what we're going to do. Um, so starting here at one, two, three, four, past the last one, I'm going to dig this way. And I'm going to go until uh, x equals 500, and then I'm going to dig this way until x equals zero. And I'm going to keep going until I'm satisfied with the amount of diamonds that we have, or until I've dug out from zero to 500 on the x and z coordinates. Uh, and I'll let you know what I find. I'll also rejoin you if anything interesting happens. So, time to get to work. Well, I finally found my first diamonds, but my inventory is 100% full. So I'm going to bring some stuff to the surface, and then I'm going to pick these up. All right, I'm back. Let's see what kind of vein we have here. At least two, three, four, Looks like probably just four. One, two, three, four. We'll dig around just a tad to see if there's more. And it appears that there is not. Which is fine. So, uh, four down. Well, four or down. I'm guessing we'll get uh, nine or uh, nine diamonds out of that. Uh, let's keep going. Well, it's only been a couple of minutes, but we've discovered more diamonds. Unfortunately, there's all sorts of lava beneath, so we're going to have to get that taken care of. Okay. Oh, we got at least six, seven, eight. Nice. Gravel may or may not come raining down on us, so let's put up a couple of caution torches and see what happens. Yup. So by my calculations, we have 12 ore. Okay. Things are looking up. What can we expect from 12 ore? Oh, I don't know, 25, 26 diamonds? Something north of two dozen. All right, I'm gonna keep, keep grinding. See you guys soon. Yes, more diamonds. All right, let's see what we get here. I'm digging around quite carefully because I don't want lava to hurt the drops here. Just in case it's around. Ooh. This is taller than I thought it would be. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, I think we're up to 18 now. Yes, 18 diamond ore. All right, let's keep working. Oh, wow, guys, more. It's only been a minute. Okay, let's dig this out and see what we get. I'm liking the look of this so far. We got four on a solid bottom level here. 
which means there could be eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Excellent. All right, and let's make sure there's nothing unsavory on top of these. And there's not. So let's collect them up and see that we're at 26 ore. Whew! It might be time to, uh, next time we go back up to the surface, to fortune what we have and see what we get. So I will join you guys topside for that event. Uh, excuse me, zombie piglin. You belong in the nether. Okay, we've got 26 diamond ore. And fortune 3 should average about 9 diamonds per 4 ore. So if we've got 6 sets of 4 ore here, 6.5, then I can expect 6 times 9. 54 diamonds? Hoping for 50. Alright, let's see what we get. Twenty, thirty, forty, fifty-four. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, we can make a full set of armor with fifty-four, um, plus have thirty left over for some tools and stuff. Um, so, I'm feeling better. So the question is then, is it time to just um, put some potatoes in the old experience machine until night so I can sleep and make any phantoms that may have appeared go away or what? I don't know. Here's our haul from mining. We got 54 iron ore, 16 gold ore, 6 lapis ore, 12 redstone ore, lots of coal ore. And I had a little bit of this before I began. Also a stack of iron in here. So... Um, glad to have replenished the iron I think I used for this little excursion. And, uh, yeah, I think we gotta keep going. So we can make sure that we have uh, everything that we need to do this well. So we hardly made a dent in our food. I do need to repair my pickaxe. Although, do I? I don't know. One, two, three. I think I will, but I think I'll... I think it's time to make diamond pickaxe, pickaxes. And, uh, maybe diamond armor for the rest of this... replenishment journey. So, let's do this. Nine. Oh, I have nine. That's why it showed up in green. I guess I got all that from mining the diamond ore just now. Okay, that's as good as new. And, um, hmm. We have leather. We have sticks. Let's put our, um, backup stuff. Let's see. 16 sticks. Like this. And two leather like this and we can have our backup emergency stuff right here silk touch and fortune cool uh, potatoes. But we don't need potatoes. What we need is fuel. We have potatoes. That we have. All right, I'm going to get some experience going, and then uh, we're going to make some diamond stuff and enchant it. All right, guys, quick update. Here's where we're at. We have got... A sharpness four sword, um, a unbreaking. What is it? Unbreaking fortune efficiency pickaxe with another efficiency pickaxe. So that'll be efficiency five when we combine them. 
Uh, we haven't enchanted these things yet. Um, we threw Luck of the C3 on the fishing rod because I got it on a book. And we have a soap touch and efficiency pickaxe. I'm excited about the boots. Depstrider 3 and Feather Falling 4. Would love to get Unbreaking 3 on those. And then I just think Protection 4 and Mending. And those will be God Boots. Um, protection 3 on the chest plate and Respiration 3 on Breaking 3 on the helmet. So we're on our way. We got 51 levels. We're ready to try some more, but it is a rainy night. So I'm going to go to sleep and stop recording for now. And I don't know if this is the end of the episode or not. But either way, I'll see you soon, sooner or later, in the basement. In the basement. <laughs> a very important part of how the basement is able to bring you the content that we do daily is our wonderful YouTube sponsors and Patreon patrons listed on the screen now. If you would like to join this amazing group of people who are helping the basement to make even more content and do even more streams, you can go ahead and click the link in the description or on the screen right now. And we'd love to have you join us in making the basement not just the friendliest place on YouTube, but the most awesome place on the planet. In our solar system. In our universe. In, in the, the basement. basement.